completely forgot to film an introduction to this video. So first we're gonna stop at Target and then we're gonna go to Ulta today. Let's see what new sunscreens they have. I found some good stuff. All right, we're at Target looking at the Oil A sunscreens because I wanted to see if they had the mineral sunscreen that I reviewed last year. This one, however, Oil A Regenerous SPF 30, that is moisturizing. If we look at the ingredients, it is all chemical. So it's not the mineral one. Well, now, one of my viewers, one of you said that they had discontinued the mineral SPF 30 version. Um, as you can see, I'm here is another sunscreen I found that looks new, Hyaluronic Peptide 24 SPF, but it is again, all chemical. But I went and checked on their website and Ole is still selling the mineral version that I reviewed last year. And they have discontinued a different sunscreen that's called Sensitive Mineral. All right, L'Oreal. I didn't even think of L'Oreal for sunscreens. They have an SPF 50 out, new Revita, Revita Lift, is that what that said? <laughs> And it is all chemical, so no white cast. I love this, it's $26. Has anybody tried this one? I'm so curious about this. It says it is a lightweight sunscreen. Urban RX, I am not familiar with this brand. This is a black owned brand, isn't it? I feel like there was some controversy at some point, but they have this hybrid sunscreen with zinc oxide, oxide and octanoxate in it that looks interesting to me. However, it said glow. So I'm probably not gonna pick this one up. <laughs> I did pick this up, however. This is the Target Up and Up brand version SPF Sunsticks, and I wanna see how this compares to the Sun Bum. You get two Sunsticks for a much cheaper price and it is all chemical sunsticks. Let's head to Ulta because of course I forgot to tell you that I was headed to Ulta. So what you'll see next is me shopping in Ulta. <laughs> Ulta, I don't know that I go to Ulta for sunscreens, do you? <laughs> but they were having a sell on a lot of brands, including the Sun Bomb. Ooh, I love Sun Bomb. Look at this cute little kit. Good vibes, you get some sunscreen and a little SPF. This would make a great gift. Mother's Day gift, Father's Day gift. I love this as a gift. They do have a line of mineral sunscreens. This is their new tinted SPF 30. I looked online and it looks like it's gonna be a little too dark for me, but it might work for some of you. Has anybody tried this? Their mineral sunscreens are all in white packaging and their chemical look like they're in the yellow and brown packaging. They also carry the Super Goop and I love, we have that giant tub of Super Goop Play SPF 50 currently at the house. My husband loves the Unsun. Now this is the Vacation Mineral Spritz. They have a new faced mist that is all chemical. I wonder if this has a scent. They also have this, the baby oil. I feel like baby oil though is a little, do we want to be promoting baby oil? <laughs> I mean, it does have a good SPF. This is the one I reviewed last year, the Mineral SPF 30. It has a very strong scent, which some people really love. And then their classic lotion in SPF 50 is all chemical. Black Girl Sunscreens. I did pick one up today that I'll show you later. CeraVe Hydrating Sheer Sunscreen. They had a lot of this in. I love this for my body, but don't like it for my face. <laughs> Neutrogenas, they had some. Oh look, they have coats. I love coats. They have the Flawless Complexion SPF 50. Love this one. In the tinted, but they also have a darker tinted version now too. The Prime and Protect SPF 40 is too dark for me, even though it's a matte sunscreen. Mad Hippie, I still have yet to try the Mad Hippie sunscreens. They had a body lotion here that I was so interested in. Fragrance free, I love their moisturizer. They have a vitamin C moisturizer that I absolutely love. Ulta has a very nice selection of Kula sunscreens. So many spray sunscreens, mineral, chemical. I don't know what the tan lotions are though. 
I found an Avenier SPF 50 that I reviewed last year, All Mineral. I like this one, but it does leave a slight white cast, but it's very thin, sits nicely on the skin. Bliss Blockstar SPF 50, again, a very nice SPF mineral sunscreen with a slight white cast, but I like it. Now here's the one, Angie off of Hot and Flashy. She swears by the R&R &R sunscreen. I still need to try this one. It is 12% zinc oxide. Have you guys tried it? I love Angie. All right, the mineral, Good Molecules Mineral is a good price. I think it's like 12, 12 or 14, I think it's $12. Has zinc oxide. There are mixed reviews online. Has anybody tried this one? It's a great price point. I'm trying to figure out where to show you my little haul from Ulta. <laughs> okay, Ulta. I only spent $18 because I had like $36 of like Ulta points, Ulta cash. So I'll show you what I got really quick, quick haul. Because I went in for one of the black girl sunscreens in the mermaid, the new mermaid print. Cause I haven't tried this one out, but they didn't have the matte version. I really wanted the matte 50 and they only had the 30. So I'm still gonna try it out, but it says moisturizing. So this will probably be a body sunscreen but my daughter and I are planning on going to see the new Little Mermaid movie when it comes out so I wanted to get the little print and then mm -hmm, I picked this up um, I'm not sure it has a lot it has eyeshadow and blush palette brow trio glitter top coat two glosses lip balm shadow primer there's a lot look it has a lot of stuff Look how pretty the case is. So I thought my daughter would like this. Oh, it has a pearl. I just noticed there's a pearl on the zipper. Okay. And then I picked myself up a new hairbrush. This is the Wet Brush Pro, which I like the pro version. I thought the pattern was really pretty. The Dean Tangle. And then my daughter also needed a new one. And she has a full size regular one, but I thought she might appreciate like a small. This is the Tangle Teaser version, a small hairbrush. So that's all I got. Today is a great day to wear sunscreen and I can't wait to try out all the new sunscreens that I picked up today.